So if I got to fight Mike Tyson and I have the best sparring partners, I have the best trainers, I got everything that I need, the best equipment, and I knock Mike Tyson out in the first round, I am a conqueror. So how then do I become more than a conqueror? So let me, let me put it to you this way. I ain't got the shoes and I ain't got the equipment and I ain't got the trainer and I ain't got the deals, but I still go into the ring and I race against Sha'Carri Richardson and I beat her. I'm not just a conqueror then. I am, come on, I ain't got the best boxing gloves. I ain't got the best equipment. I ain't got no trainer, but I go into the ring and I knock Mike Tyson out. I'm not just a conqueror. I am some of y'all don't get it yet because you came to church in your nice car and you go home to an air-conditioned home and you got money in the bank you got a happy husband and a good marriage ain't nothing going on with your children you come into the house of God and you worship and you shout congratulations you are a conqueror but some of us got hell going on in our lives some of us ain't got no good marriage some of us got stuff going on in the job but I come into the house of God and I praise him just like you do I am not just a conqueror I am more than a conqueror come on somebody put your hand together and praise God tonight you're not just a conqueror you are more than a conqueror it's what you go through that determines your anointing it's what you go through it's the long suffering that makes you more than a conqueror